welcome back to the channel if you are new thank you so much for being here y'all go ahead and hit that like button before we get started usually in these videos i will tell you to get a few items here and there every week when you go out this is not that video today i'm telling you you need to go out right now if you can and get as much as you can while it is still there find the sales where you can this particular store had some sales but as you can see they have a lot of empty and bare shelves along with a lot of food shortages and non-food shortages things are not getting any better it is said that this will last at least six months and if the news is telling you that it will last at least six months you might want to add six to 12 more months on to that because they will not tell you anything until it's too late and when they do tell you they're not going to give you all of the information this is what i've been doing all along get the items you need for your family now is not the time to procrastinate most of you have gone out because I read your comments and I thank you and your family thanks you because you're not doing it for me. You're doing it for your family. Don't be some of the people that are dealing with um, not being able to get their food orders when they're ordering Instacart and they're going to pick it up or it's being delivered to them and either the items are not there for the salesperson to shop and get it for them and then they don't have what they need for their family and then they still end up having to go out from store to store to find what they need don't be that person don't be a panic buyer as well get what you need right now yes there is a shortage of food and non-food products but there's also a shortage of labor there aren't enough workers either they're sick or they don't want to work for the amount of money they're being paid and put their lives at jeopardy and they're being mistreated by some customers who are impatient. So imagine going to a grocery store and that store not being open because they don't have workers or they don't have the food um, on the shelves for you to purchase for your family. Things will get violent. Don't be out there with those people. The people that waited until the last minute when they knew all along that this was happening but gave every excuse for why they didn't get what they need. The following pictures are of a grocery store in Washington State. Due to the severe weather that they had, a lot of trucks could not get through uh, the roads to get food to the stores. So this is how many of the stores are looking. This could happen anywhere. What we do know is that we could be in this crunch at least for the next six months. So again, don't forget to hit that like button as it does help YouTube get my videos out to more and more people. Everyone needs to know that they need to be prepping right now before it's too late.